Jim Nance and Nick Faldo exclusively for CBSSports.com at the Quail Hollow Championship here in Charlotte. Sean O'Hare with a final round 69 wins by one over Bubba Watson and Lucas Glover and Tiger Woods finished fourth. How big a win is this for Sean O'Hare? Oh, it's massive. We've had a great weekend here. A great golf course set up really well. But and his ball striking is, has been phenomenal. His stats unbelievable. He, he, may, he did not make a putt outside 10 feet and you win the tournament with 11 under par on this kind of golf course. That is quite incredible. Hard to believe. Tiger Woods had the first day lead on Thursday by two, but the rest of the week, he never had a round like Thursday. Mm. He shot 72 today and, uh, well, finishes fourth. What did you make of his well, performance? Well, two clubs, really. The, the, the driver is, is, is just not acting the same. He's driven brilliantly with the three wood, absolutely, literally perfect every shot, but the driver just doesn't match. He's left and right by, you know, a good 20 or 30 yards. And the putter, I think he's putting them well. And I think probably in his own words, he said he's hitting his points, uh, but basically he's not reading them as well as he was, you know, end of last year, which kind of can be understandable. You've had, a, you've had eight, nine, nine months off. You know, that is the hardest thing to come back in and mm. see everything exactly the same. Congratulations again to Sean O'Hare, a winner on tour for the third time. This, his most impressive conquest. For Nick and all the crew, Jim Nance saying so long for now. We'll see you in two weeks' time from the Valero Texas Open in San Antonio.